Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. So for once, it's not chaotic back here, which is amazing. But if you're new, hi, my name is Sarah. I make lifestyle and beauty videos here on the World Wide Web. And I would love it if you guys were to subscribe so you don't miss out on any content. Today's video is going to be product empties. Now it's garbage day, so I have to do this quick. So I have been just collecting my garbage for a month if, when I remember. So I'm just gonna pull the products out and we are going to talk about them if I love it or hate it. So product number one is this Bioterra Color Care Shampoo. Um, there's no free of parabens. It, it has grape, ex grape seed extract, which honestly I get this at Sally Beauty and this is one of my favorite shampoos. My sister had this and it just like cleaned my hair. So I always go back to this one or uh, any brand by Live Clean, which brings me to my next one. This is Live Clean Pink Fire Color Protect Conditioner. So I color my hair. I used to do it like once a month, but now I just kind of just let it roll and hope for the best. But yeah, this one is free. Uh, it's plain to drop plant derived um sulfate free paraben free it's just really good so i love live clean this one i don't think i liked as much as the other ones that i have tried i love the argan oil one or the coconut one um actually no that's a lie i don't like the coconut one it leaves my hair really dry um so yeah anything by live clean is amazing this is their conditioner um as you can tell i love my cellar water i have four of these so these ones are for sensitive skin it's an all-in-one my cellar water uh it soothes and removes makeup this this one is also sensitive skin so there is another one down here yeah i love micellar water by garnier one of my favorite products is this here so anything by garnier micellar water you can put it on a con pad put it on your face it takes off an eyebrow in like three seconds love that for me and next one this is so disgusting as you can see i've used it and there's hair in it this is live clean it is their coconut milk um body wash and it's so gross to look at well look at this again it is plant derived naturally natural ingredients it's cruelty free which i love anything cruelty free and this one just smells like a tropical vacation so sign me up i always gravitate towards live clean products when it comes to like body care and hair care just you know plant-based stuff is really good for your body this leave-in conditioner i'm pretty sure is my all-time favorite it is by virtue it is their create six in one styler it shine texturizes and protects and it is uh, has alpha creatine in it which we love that so it is this guy here i get him from well actually this was gifted to me from chatter's hair salon um but yeah this one is really good it's not thick doesn't leave your hair greasy smells good real science true beauty so I love this one here. Um, I use the whole thing. Normally if I don't like it, I won't use the whole thing. I'll just get rid of it, which is bad, but c'est la vie. So some more body care. This is from Alouette. This is Rejuvenate Body Scrub. Alouette is like a, people would say pyramid scheme company, but I mean, they do have really good products. So I don't knock on it. I also sell that too. But yeah, this is a body scrub from Alouette. It is so good. It smells nice. It's fine. It's not too grainy. It doesn't leave you like greasy, which, you know, who doesn't, who wants to feel greasy. Last kind of like body wash kind of situation is this Yves Rocher Melting Orange um, Foaming Hand Wash. It is so good. It's a hand soap. It smells so good and I used it till I, there was nothing left. This one it is, I wish you could smell through the screen. I always say that, but I truly wish you could because this is just a dream. It smells so good. And right now we have like a juicy berry one. Oh my goodness. It smells so freaking good. Moving on to some makeup. Oh wait, one last thing. Garnier Nutris. They're little conditioners that come in when you dye your hair can't go wrong with those toothpaste um i love crest pro health gum detoxifying deep clean we just love to see it um this product here again speaking of love to see it this is estee lauder's micro essence skin activating treatment lotion fresh with sacru sacra ferment i was gifted this for my first ever event back in i think it was like right before the pandemic and this is just it's so good this one was my second one and i just honestly the bottle is beautiful and it's just beautiful product it smells so good i love this one i recommend it it's a little pricey but like i think it's worth the price it just leaves your skin so smooth and so fresh and i just love it lots okay we're gonna talk about one of my favorite mascaras because i see i have three of them in here i love the essence lash princess fall slash effect i think rach loves um introduced me to this when i was watching her channel she kept talking about essence 
this one. I'm pretty sure it was this one. And I'm obsessed. These ones last quite a while, even though I always say like the larger products always dry out faster because you're not using it as quick. So buy the minis, but you can't buy minis of these. And this is just a really solid product from Essence. And it's fairly cheap. It's like $4, $5. You honestly cannot go wrong with that. Some more mascara. Oh, this one. Okay, also this mascara by Essence, the Volume Stylus 18 Hour Lash, Lash Extension Mascara with Lengthening Fibers. This one is amazing. Mixed with this, it's a dream combination. I used to use um, Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara, I think that's what it was, and Benefit Roller Lash combined. Oh my God, best lashes I ever had in my whole life and I need to get that back in my life because my eyelashes were like, hello, and now they're kind of like, uh, hi, you know, so. Yeah, um, also Tower Beauty is sent over this one. This is their uh, Jet Make Waves Mascara. I love this one. I got this like a couple months back and again, obviously it's empty. It's like crusted, I can't even open it. But really good wand. I love this. Again, lightweight and just a good mascara. Okay, sticking with Tower Beauty, we have their Tower Beauty um, Daily Rescue Facial Spray, which I love this one. It's like a ch -ch -ch mist and call it a day and you're good to go. Really like this one, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, oil-free, it's hyperallergenic. You can use daily AM and PM um, on cleansed skin. Let dry before using moisturizing. And it's just really good. I really like this. I think anybody can use it any ages. And then this is their um, Tower Beauty. Oh, this is another one of them. I'm pretty sure. Daily Rescue SOS. Yeah, it is. Look at that. Love it. It was a good one. I had to get it twice. Um, okay, let's talk about eyebrows. The elephant in the room. So I have two of these guys here. These are the Benefit Precisely My Brow. Love this one. It's like the thinner, um, you can't really see it. <laughs> it's like the smaller kind of um, ch -ch -ch, which I use to like stencil my eye. And it also has like a little spoolie, spoolie on the back there. And then I also use the Goof Proof Brow Pencil in 3.75 or 3.5. And this one I use the 3.75. So it just kind of depends. Like they're pretty dark as you can see. I like a dark brow. This one is kind of just, again, it's busted, but this one is like a chunkier, um, ang angular <laughs> kind of um, pencil, I guess you could say. And I just really like this one a lot to color in after I have mapped out my brows. So Benefit is honestly my go to. I used to be an Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pomade. I love that stuff to the gray, but then my eyebrows were like in a weird stage in my life that time around. So I'm more confident about these brows now, but whatever to each their own. Um, so yeah, that's my brow pencils that I love. I go through those like it's my job. It's disgusting. Um, and then the Inky List Caffeine Eye Cream helps reduce under eye puffiness. I use this guy. I liked it better than the, um, ordinary one I was using on uh, the ordinary coffee or caffeine solution kind of was just like gross like I liked it but I didn't love it this one I really liked but right now I'm on a CeraVe one which I am way more obsessed with it's expensive but a little goes a long way so I mean this is the Yankee list it's good it's cheap it's a good alternative speaking of the ordinary this is their niacinamide drop thing <laughs> I don't know I use this I used to use this all the time uh, I just put this on my face pat it out um and I just use that a lot because I really liked it again really good but now I'm on a different one from a different brand trying different brands out but yeah that is my video about my product empties now I'm gonna go run these out to the garbage anyways so that is going to be this video if you liked it make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below if you use any of these products or if you have any alternatives to any of these products or products you want me to try out and like I said like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video thanks so much for watching